hit the subscribe button and click on bell icon for getting new updates welcome to my youtube channel so guys today i'll show you how to install kali linux in virtual box which is easiest and correct way so you have to download the virtual box and you have to download the pre-built virtual machine image which is here you can check the link below the installer you don't need to download the any installer so you have to download the pre-built virtual image so here you have to click here I am also give the link in description where you can see the VMware image virtual box image as well as Hyper-V image is available here so you have to download the virtual image according to your hardware 64 or 32 bit I already download the file with extension .ova so now here guys you can check the time so we can show how much time it will took to install the Kali Linux so you have to import the file so you have to click on import and here local file system so now you have to find the file so click here and go to your dot ova file so this is my dot ova file and then click on open and here our destination is here our source path is here where is our file is saved so click on next and here guys this is the pre-built virtual machine so this is the configuration of this virtual machine you can check by yourself you can change afterward right now you have to import it and here you have to accept the agreement so now your virtual machine is importing so I'll skip this video so it will took some time So now importing almost done so here you can check our virtual machine is done here now our new virtual machine is created so now you, we have to go to the settings and we have to change the settings according to our hardware which our need so by default settings are here you can check by default name is here all the detail name type and version so you can check this is our location where our virtual machine is saved so this is the advance and this is the description here you can check the default username default password is also available in description so this is the system setting you can give the RAM according to your hardware and the chipset or point USB you can check according to your this is the processor your CPU core you can give the CPU core according to your hardware by default virtual machine on minimal hardware if you don't need to change you cannot change simply start the virtual machine but if you want to change the hardware settings so you can change the settings according to your hardware so now our virtual machine is done here now you can check the time how much time it will took so this is approximate take 11 to 12 minutes so here guys this is the good thing we can install the Kali Linux in virtual box within 11 to 12 minutes this is the good thing so our Kali Linux is booting up first time so here guys you can check our Kali Linux is running in virtual box so this is the latest version of Kali Linux 2020.1 so here guys you can check our Kali Linux is running and here you can notice the virtual guest edition tool is already installed in this version so you don't need to install manually virtual box guest edition tool you don't need to install this is 
pre-built virtual image so all the necessary tools is installed already so here you have to log in with the username Kali and password is also Kali previous version of Kali Linux where root is default name and default password is tour but now root is not working anymore so default username and password is Kali you can access root afterward but in login time you cannot log in with root so here guys our Kali Linux is running in virtual box within 11 to 12 minutes so this is the best way to install Kali Linux in virtual box so here guys you can check here I am showing you the latest version and the kernel you can check here in terminal I am showing you the latest version of Kali Linux so you can verify so this is the latest version of Kali Linux 2020.1 so this is the Kali Linux so you can install Kali Linux in virtual box within 10 to 11 minutes without any error you cannot get any error any TTY any guest edition tool you don't need to install any tools simply you have to download the image import the image and just using Kali Linux without any error so this is the best way and correct way to install Kali Linux in virtual box so here you can check I am using Kali Linux and all the tools is here so now I am start my second virtual machine which is I installed manually I download the installer manually and then I create this virtual machine and install the Kali Linux in virtual box so it took approximate 30 to 40 minutes when I installed the Kali Linux in virtual box and now I am starting up this virtual box and I am showing the main difference between both of them both, both the virtual machine working fine almost all thing is same but you can get some new features and some more features which is pre-built images so I am showing you the main difference between both of them so here guys our virtual machine is setting up so my username is techthe and password is which I set it so if you want to create new user which is pre-built virtual machine Kali and username is Kali and password is also Kali you can create new user click on i button where I explain how to create new user so here guys you can check the main difference our virtual additional tool is not installed which is I installed we have to install manually virtual guest addition tool and pre-built pre-installed virtual box have all the tools so this is the main difference between both of them so you can check by yourself which virtual machine is working fine so which virtual machine I installed I have to install the virtual guest tool by manually but in this virtual machine all the tools is pre-installed just we have to download import the file in virtual box and use it without any error so here guys I suggest if you want to install the Kali Linux in virtual box VMware or Hyper-V so you have to download the official image which is available on official website of Kali Linux if you want to install the Kali Linux in physical machine so that time you have to download the installer so it will took some time to installation but if you want to install the Kali Linux in virtual box so I recommend this so this is the fastest and easiest way to install the Kali Linux in virtual box so this is the way how we can install Kali Linux in virtual box so thank you for watching this video thank you very much